Okay, let's talk about character uh, panel. If you type any text with any font, in a settings, as I said before, you can click on character button here and it appears character bat panel, or you can go to the window in the text, we have a character. In this character, we have lots of our settings that you can use it. For example, from here, you can again choose any font that you want. We choose any different. This, for example, we have this font and we have regular, bold, or anything that you want. Depend on your fonts, we have a different mode here. You can choose uh, the size of your font again and a style that I explain it later. You can decorations, decorations part, you can use underline or double underline. You can change the color of the underlines here. You can see it. And uh, you can delete all the underline. If you double click and change uh, any click and drag and change the color of this part of text, the underline will be changed according that, to that. You can use uh, strike through like this. Don't forget, you have to select in this first select with mode tool and then select the strike through. Double here, you can change it. Here we have stroke settings. You can add any stroke to your uh, font that you want. Special here, you can align stroke to inside, middle, and outside. I explained it before. You can use a dash, you can use a brush. Uh, textures and that's it you can use the strokes if you want you can change the stroke color if you want here we have all of this position and transfer sitting here first is the kerning as you can see it's turned off because you have to bring your mouse or cursor uh, he is between the, the letters between the letters and it turned off and you can control the let's turn off the stroke then you can control the <coughs> uh, spacing between the letters you can use this you can go in your mouse over here or type any number that you want or scrolling your mouse and uh, again select that in the tracking it changed the uh, all a letters uh, spacing at once. Here is baseline. <clears throat> In this case, you have to select a letter and then you can change the baseline sitting. It means you can change the position of the letter uh, in this way. Uh, vertically. Or here you can change leading over right. It means if you uh, have a <clears throat> paragraph text like this, like this, sorry for that, and then you select it, you can change the line up between these, uh, the space between the line of the paragraph. <clears throat> And here you can use sharing. Nice. You can change uh, scale of the uh, all of the letters at once in hor vertical, horizontal, or vertical. Nice. You can use a superscript or subscript. That I prefer that using this. For example, in this mode. Oh, another thing from here is this typography settings from there. For example, you want to make this all of these settings um, capital. You can use it, this all cap. Let's make it a capital. Or, for example, you want to make all of the other letters less capital smaller capital like this t is more bigger <clears throat> for example
from this you can select to make it subscript or super nice or for example i have a fraction here you can simply select that and fraction these two are a standard literature or um, <clears throat> contextual alternative is for such as these things for example we have a special font in some fonts in some fonts they are turned off be careful about that or these artistic sets swash or character variants it's all about this for example swash is something like this it's add a additional tail to your <clears throat> uh, to your font that i don't use them you can manually draw anything any phone that you want in the, the, the um, affinity designer this is literature literature yeah i spell it bad standard ligature yeah sorry and here <clears throat> for example ff it's melting together <clears throat> deleting i something like this it's changing them a little let's try with this as you can see it does not work because we need a special font special font to see <clears throat> it's better let's find a special font something like this double click mm, as you can see in this font all of them are turned off in this font let's try another font yeah one of them is turned on hmm, does not change it's different on depend on your font oh, for example in this font it's oh it's turned off i don't know it's you have to find oh, in this font it's turned on it does not take effect ah it's that and for example uh, in this uh, alternatives what is that again contextual the text is changing itself depend on the letters around it something like this it's deleting this part for better more beautiful writing handwriting hmm? these are you can the special fonts that you can see that <clears throat> and here is language you can choose a, a spelling language you can make it none you can if you can make it none it does not give you another any error <clears throat> that red line for example uh in it checking the english united states and tell okay this tutorial says we don't have the letter like this if you separate the tutorial from the cells it's let's delete on the line it tells you yeah we have something like that and it doesn't give you an error <clears throat> if you if you connecting to each other and then it's spelling at english united states and it's automatically um, correct all of the issues and if you uh, write anything wrong for example something like this it gives you an error that we don't have any <clears throat> word like this in english united states and optical alignment is for a special character in your paragraph you can alignment especially for the margins I don't use them because it's more complex. It's a lot of settings that you can change, but just you can use a very important positioning and transforming very important, uh, or uh, we use superscript or subscript or capital more in uh, our way to designing. Okay, this is a character.
Hello my friends, to continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now, you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.